Hi, I'm Jing Yunho. I'm from University of Otago. I'll introduce our work cross-domain latent modulation for virus signal transfer learning in this presentation. Transfer learning aims to extract the knowledge from one or more source tasks and applies the knowledge to a target task. There are many different settings for the transfer learning. In this work, we consider the homogeneous transfer learning. That means the source and the target have the same feature space, but with domain shaped. Then, the adaptation models are used to align them and transfer knowledge learned from the source to the target. In our work, we consider the pixel level homogeneous transfer learning using virus signal inference model, virus signal autoencoder. Due to the coupling theory, we propose a novel transfer latent space, TLS, and the constraints for the joint distribution for better performance. That is a function f. It extracts the domain moments information omic and the deep representation h for the source and the target. Then, a transfer map G can be contracted to generate the latent variable from omic and h with uh, domain crossover. This reminds us a technology called modulation used in communication, which a message signal is modulated onto the carrier by a modulator. So, we call our model cross-domain latent modulation. Then, the next problem is how to instance a TLS. Under the very original autoencoder scenario, the repaminalization is a natural choice. So, we propose a modified repaminalization for this. In the structure, deep repetition along with the auxiliary noise work as the perturbations in a cross-domain manner. Then, for the ith element of the distribution moments, we have, for example, mu s t can be regarded as the location shift of mu s under the influence of the target. Also, the sigma s t can be regarded as the recoloring of the sigma s under the influence of the target. Finally, the cross consistency are built between the reconstructions and the generations for a further alignment in the inner class level. This is our model's architecture. H and omega are extracted by the encoder in a parallel way. Then the deep representation is modulated on the domain information. Then the reconstructions and the generations are obtained. The blue lines are for the target and the white lines are for the source. Finally, the learning rules guide the training. For the learning, there are lower bound regularizations and was real learning loss function. Also, the cross consistency plays an important role. We consider the unsupervised domain adaptation, UDA, and cross domain image mapping scenarios in the experiments. First, for the UDA, we can see that our model's performance is better than the uh, compared methods. Also, our model can visualize the adaptation results. We can see that all the tasks transfer the target to the source style very well. This makes sure that our model has a better adaptation performance. Besides, the TSE mapping show that our model aligns the source and the target well furthermore. For the image mapping, we can see that our model translates the uh, age to source and phase to schedule well. Also, the quantitative results of the mapping show that our model is effective. Our model also performs the ECDRD and matches the performance of the star gain. So, in our paper, first, we propose a novel transfer latent space under the very general inference scenario. Then, we introduce the TLS with the proposed modification find the repaminalization. The deep representations work as cross-domain perturbations. Finally, as per parameters results show that our model is effective. Thank you for your watching. For more detail, please go to our paper. Thank you.